Back. Hello and welcome to Cloud Jam. In this video, I am going to let you know about the resources or the learning materials that you can use to prepare for your AWS Solutions Architect exam. I have scheduled my exam two days from now and I have referred a lot of resources, a lot of learning materials. So I am fit to make this video. Uh, there are many resources available online. There are many courses. It is very hard for you to find the right resource. So I am here to help you out. I'll be letting you know which resources are good for you. There are paid resources, there are free resources. So let's start with the paid resources first. There are many courses available online. So I would suggest the two courses on Udemy. The first one is the course by Stefan Marek. You can check it out. This, this course by Stefan Marek is an awesome. Stefan is Stefan is an awesome instructor. He explains AWS in very easy and simple manner along with hands-on and detailed detailed uh, practice uh, he also gives sample questions at the end of each module so this is a course you want to go for if you are someone who has no knowledge about AWS there are a lot of reviews about this course as well the second course I would recommend is the course by Neil Davis Neil is an awesome instructor I love him and I'm referring his notes his courses or, a lot, or especially especially uh, exam cram because my exam is in next two days so I'm revising things and exam cram are very helpful so this is the course by informative and Davis. very detailed this course is highly uh, on the point and there are a lot of good reviews as well so this is the second course I would recommend you can choose any of these courses either Stefan course or the course by Neil Davis both of them are an awesome instructor and but there are some change, there are some things you can check it out if you have money you can go buy if you have money and time you can go buy both of them and refer both of them but it's not uh, it's not necessary you can it's not necessary you can choose any one of them and they, they it can prepare you for the exam quite good so the third thing i am used third thing i would recommend you to use to practice is the Practice question by John Bonso or Tutorials Dojo. This is the Solutions Architect for Associate Practice Exams uh, which I am practicing on. So there are six set of questions by Tutorials Dojo or John Bonso and they are highly helpful, very good. I practice them every morning and every evening. It helps me prepare for the exam. You should try them after learning any of the topic because it will help you a lot. So these were, the paid, these were the paid courses or paid resources available. You can also try the course by Adrian Cantrell. I have heard, I have read a lot of reviews by them, but I have not uh, used it, so not recommending. But you can go check it out if you have ample of time or money. The next, now we will discuss the free resources. So there are courses by AWS itself on, for, to, there are courses by AWS itself to prepare for the solutions architect. The first is the exam readiness on the AWS skill builder. So you can go on the AWS Solutions Architect Associate exam and click on the first link. Now you can scroll down and prepare for the exam. Here you will get all the free resources by AWS itself. Uh, the courses you can go, you can choose this exam readiness digital training or you can use this. To prepare for AWS Solutions Architect Associate exam, there are also free question paper, free practice questions by AWS. So this is the free practice set. So these are the resources which will help you to prepare for your exam. And I will guarantee you, if you follow along, if you refer these resources, you will pass your exam in first attempt. And hopefully, I do too. I'm going to appear for my exam in next two days. I'll be posting my result if I passed or failed. I hope I don't fail but I won't I think uh, so I'll be posting my results somewhere here you can go check it out if you're watching this video after the exam and that's all if you find this video helpful please like this video and subscribe to the channel I'm going to post more videos on cloud computing devops and see you 